Squirrel Season Wrap-Up, William Hovey Smith, 2014. I am the author of Backyard Deer Hunting and also a series of muzzleloading e-books, including Muzzleloaders for Hunters, which include squirrel hunting. Now, the Crockett rifle I built from a kit and it's a squirrel rifle and it is for sale. This is a Mortimer Flitlock Fowler, and here are two Alabama squirrels I took with it, and now a close-up of the gun and self-same squirrels. Now, I used a series of guns in an article I did once upon a time, and here they are, ranging from match locks to inlines, and all of them took squirrels, as did this 58 caliber Harper's Ferry pistol and the Ruger Old Army here, which I also used to take alligator. Yeah! This is seemingly not a likely squirrel hunting place, day, or way. But we are getting squirrels. It has been lightly raining for a couple of days. And I am in a real thick cutover. Yeah. Uh, this stuff is hard to get through. And I just shot a squirrel out of that tree at a range of about 20 odd yards. Yeah, he was barking and I came in and sat down on my stool and just waited until he moved again. And then I finally could see him and shot him. Yep. Wow. But this is about five year cut over in Georgia and it is very, very thick indeed. Nonetheless, there are oak trees, and they have acorns, and where there are acorns, there will be squirrels, even if these are not mature trees by an awful long shot. Hmm, quite unlike other places on my farm where I do have mature trees and do take squirrels out of them. But uh, yeah, this is just another place and another way. Although the early afternoon has started off very slow indeed, uh, now it is about 4.40, and the squirrels are starting to move a little bit. Uh, they're starting to talk a little bit and actually move on the ground. This was one of two who were chasing each other, and I took one of them. Of course, having only a single shot, the other one was long gone by the time I reloaded. But, uh, yeah, things are picking up. Unfortunately, that was it for that squirrel season, and I saw absolutely nothing else for the rest of the month. Although, a week later, when I went to Charlie Elliott for my seminar, there were squirrels absolutely everywhere. Well, I'm the author of Extreme Muzzleloading, as well as Crossbow Hunting, and a series of e-books featuring muzzleloading guns including several that talk about squirrel hunting, like hunting with muzzle-loading revolvers. Now, my new book is Ideas for New Businesses, which is how you can do a million or billion dollar business using your own creative instincts. For more information on my books and blogs and more than 400 videos, go to my website, www.hoviesmith.com. Now the Crockett Rifle is for sale. Goodbye and God bless.